Okay, so how I made this frame holder was first I got this frame from the thrift store and I also got this um, rug cloth for latch hooking um, and I was trying to cut it to the size of my frame. The first time I made one of these, I put it like in the inside of the frame, not on the back of it, but in that kind of like ridge area. But with this one, I didn't do that. Um, I was kind of trying to put it along the back because it didn't seem like the ridge would work. I cut it kind of haphazardly, honestly. Um, and then I was folding down the parts of the frame. There's a, There were really, these little like hook clip things in it, which weren't in my last frame either. And I was folding them down because I wasn't really sure what to do with them. And I didn't want to kind of completely remove them because I didn't really feel like it. And I also didn't want to mess up the frame. So um, I folded them downwards so that I could glue on top of them. And then I um, started tracing around my frame to cut it to a better size so that it wouldn't overlap too much. The first time I made one of these, I used clothespins or barrettes. I don't remember which to hold down the mesh while I was gluing. Um, but with this one, I didn't have any binder clips and this frame was a lot thicker. So I couldn't use clothespins. You'll see me try. And I cut out me trying for way longer than I should have, honestly. But um, I ended up using the clips that I had initially unfurled, I mean, furled down. Um, so you'll see me unfurling them a bit and then using them to hold the mesh in place. I honestly probably could have just left them um, with that. With without gluing, um, but I decided to glue it down for added security. I think I'm gonna make a few of these also, so I wanted to experiment with some different methods. Like in this one, I did the glue thing, had the clips, and did it over the back, versus with the old one, I just used glue. There were none of those little clips that I'm unfurling right now, and I did it inside the ridge. So I'll experiment as I find different cute frames. I really like using old thrift store frames. I made them, they're really good for making mirrors too, and that's something I, a project that I plan to do soon, probably when I move because I have a really big mirror in the temporary place I'm staying in right now. Um, but yeah, from there I use I used the clips to go into the mesh and um, after that I just start gluing. It's a pretty, it's a really really simple and easy project. Um, it was fun too and very needed because so many of my earrings have gotten lost because I haven't had a jewelry organizer for a while. And it looks so cute. So I'm pretty happy with it. Next part is just me gluing very basic. I have a lot of crafts that I'm planning to make in the future. Um, but I was really, this is one of the ones that I am most happy with. Um, one of the next ones I'm making is like a ring holder. Um, but yeah, this is how the frame looks on my wall.